Hello and welcome to the 1987 Legends here at Watkins Glen. We're road racing, old style here today. Um, might get a little bit more off-road than I want to because this is so tough. These things are always so tough to get around road horses and uh, I've yet to actually have a clean lap. Not that I'm hitting the wall, but I just, I haven't had a lap where I haven't made at least one mistake yet. <laughs> and that's probably not good. So, it's just, it's so tough. I'm just going to try to survive this race. See what happens. You just got to slow down so early for the corners. It's unbelievable. I'm just going to try to focus on hitting my marks, making it to the end. You know, we'll, we'll see how it goes. Green, green, green. All right. Uh, I am the number two, unfortunately, because I do too much road racing. None of that skill, or what iRacing thinks the skill is going to translate here. So, don't expect a second place. I sure don't. Oh, whoa. That was a lag spike. Can I not have that happen during the S's, please? You know, straight away, okay, go ahead. But <laughs> Alright. Well, so far so okay, I guess. Drive in a little hard here. Make sure I get this thing slowed down. Oh man, these lag spikes, they need to stop. Yeah, Gavin saying, yeah, he'll see me when I lap him. No. No, 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 no. P3. You will see me at the exit of turn one, shattered into a thousand pieces. <laughs> that was, uh, I think, my all time best lap right there, at least. Still not very good. 113.3 seems to be the best right now. But I, uh, I have almost zero confidence that I'm going to make it to the end of this thing without having a broken car. Alright, well, we'll see how this lap does. We go from a 13.883 to an 8.52, so just barely better. Oh, that was much better than I was doing in practice for what that's worth. So we'll go ahead and get out of the car. Yeah, uh, gonna give it my best, but it's gonna be a long race and a lot of opportunity for me to end up. I love my volume just a tiny bit. It's a little bit loud. All right. 
So 13.8 is where I am. Yeah. Uh, landing in here. And the number 15. Looking nice Billy. Billy's very good lap. He's got the pole. Joe. Yeah, they redo this track and they still have to have it to a full pace lap. Gavin. Nick's in here. Yeah, I was wondering that. Why they don't Gavin, whose community time slot this is, is uh, choosing not to qualify. Start at this point. And a couple other guys that we also know. Because it's an old track. <sighs> One left to green. So we're just going to have to be very, very careful early on. And for the rest of the race. But also early on. Oh, they don't have the C3 spoilers. Rob put a bolt on your car. No pitting, I don't think. Not on Estimated the 33 laps. It's going to be on the Arca. I uh, don't expect it all to be consistent in any way, <laughs> shape, or form. I'll try to keep up with my all time, all -time optimal as much as I can. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing here, and I'm a road racer. Tires are probably going to go away, though. <laughs> So I'll have to switch to like last lap or something probably. Big key is going to be breaking. Yeah, the open wheelers are a lot different from this. In plenty of time. Yeah, this thing is like uh, yeah. <laughs> well, okay. Joe's apparently pretty good at this. Uh, he is starting ninth. I remember he said that uh, in Gavin's chat, Discord chat, that uh, this combo was the only race he ever qualified pole and finished first. And uh, that's pretty awesome. So he's probably going to do pretty good. He seems to do pretty good with road racing a lot of the time. Anytime I've seen him in, in a race. I bet he'll do a good job. You're going to want to by the time these tires are blown out. <laughs> We got someone starting on pit road. Apologies for the wait, I was being a big chicken. I am going to be going super soft early on. Just to make sure I'm not running into anybody. Don't want to overdo it either and end up uh, breaking too early and having someone else get in the back of me. Because, you know, if you overdo it, it's kind of your fault if you're, like, you know, my fault, I mean, if uh, I'm breaking way too early and someone's not expecting it, so. Can't overdo it either. What gear are we starting at? I think I'm just, it looks like you get a jump from first gear, but I think I'm just going to do second gear because I don't really need that jump. We can win it in turn <laughs> one, right? Of course you can. Terrific. Let's... You can win... Uh... It depends on how good you are at bowling. <laughs> you can win it on entry. I'm not so sure you can win it on exit of one, though. Pro tip, yeah. <laughs> Mine did up in first on entry. But I don't know if you're going to be first when you leave. <laughs> Turn one. So, quite nervous, but just going to keep it steady, keep it smooth, keep it calm, and hopefully everyone around us will do the same. The only thing I adjusted was my brake bias. I moved it up a little bit, just to get extra braking power, because this thing doesn't want to slow down. So... Okay. Okay. Car right. Stay on the left. Still there. Hold your line. Clear. Get single file. That feels good. Oh, that can be. 
We already have a second behind us. How is that possible? What happened? <laughs> I had to pay attention to what I was doing. I wonder if they got into some trouble up there. Just gonna break way early. Alright. So far so good. We need some space already. I love it. Easing it in. No, sorry. We got some people having trouble back there. Sorry about it. It's like Landon might be letting me by. I don't know. Being, really? No, I think he's protecting the inside. <laughs> the opposite of letting me by. Hey, this is already going better than I expected. Pretty darn fun to drive though. Once you get the the hang of it a little bit, it is pretty fun. One thirteen point five. That lap was a one fourteen point three. Left side. Clear. Getting held up here. I don't know how to safely pass someone. To be honest, nothing feels safe here. He break, hit the brakes a little Breaking earlier than I thought he was going to. It's okay. That lap time was 114.9. Sorry about that, Joe. No, I just missed the corner. I just cannot get past him. Money shifted it. Damn it. Being a baby, too. <laughs> but I don't want to wreck anybody. All right, so we are good on fuel. Did want to make sure on that. Your last lap time was at one fourteen point eight.
Ooh, we got like five seconds behind us now. What All right. the fuck is that? If I can keep it on track, top five's looking good. I love it. Ooh, a little bit of blink going on. Seems like Moody has that at least like once a race. Wow. I have some blinking moments. Alright, so it felt like I might have been a little bit faster than landing up there uh, earlier, but I think we're pretty equal on pace now. I'm probably being really bad to the tires or something. I'm not doing, I'm trying to do anything with the tires, to be honest with you. I am just solely concerned about making it around the track safe. <laughs> Got sideways, got on the gas a little bit too hard. I thought I could get away with it because I short shifted, but nope. <laughs> Still too much tire. Too much power. Ooh, almost got an off track there. Almost followed uh, guys ahead. Oh, got a guy going wide, maybe? Just barely. Nothing too substantial. <laughs> Was late to shift there. Oh, wow. He's just absolutely cutting his nose off. That was dangerous. Not really trying it there, but want to show the nose. This is tough. <laughs> yeah, a little loose out of the uh, uh, S's there. Had to chase it. Well, we got contact, maybe. Gotta be real careful going over that curb. It can really unsettle the car. We got too wide ahead. Break early. As you know, they have to. I am just so afraid to even try to make a pass, to be honest. Thanks, I barely made it. <laughs> Gotta hit the brakes too hard. So frustrating. Got on the brakes too hard and I had to avoid him.
Now I gotta watch out, tires gonna be hot. Just what I needed, him to start blinking. He's going off track. Can't get on his inside though. Blinking. Tires feel awful. So we're still okay, I guess. It's frustrating. I mean, obviously it's my fault for spinning. Guy just hit the brakes. Much harder than I was expecting, and then that made me had to get on the brakes harder, and it was too much for me to handle. It's happening again. Oh my god. This guy misses turn one every lap. This is tough. Cross me over, God. <laughs> Please, I don't want to waste any more time. <sighs> Let me get away, please. Wow. Don't, don't dive it in on me. You jerk. There's no way he's sticking it, is it? All right, we gained a lot of time there, thankfully. God, I'm terrible. Oh. 
I'm not racing well at all right now. This thing is hard to control. Okay, Colton, gaining on this car. The gap is 3.1. Got the eight charging hard. My God, this setup is awful. It's like we're gonna get past eventually. Car's not turning at all anymore. Ooh. Halfway home. Fuel looks good. That lap time was on sixteen point zero. Okay, Colton, that's good consistency. Keep it up. Might be catching up to uh, Rock Chan up there. Oh. All right, we got 11 to go right now. Thing, such a handful it just won't stop getting loose at every point right side still there stay on the left clear that guy was always gonna pass me 19's coming back Chair and desk are both sliding all over the place. <laughs> to go. This time it's a workout here. Come on, get your head back into it. Keep it smooth. Focus on these lines. Eighth place. Hmm. Got Lewis kind of went into the curve a little bit there. Move my desk back. I've yanked it all the way across the room. <laughs> my So catching up to Gavin up there, Sector losing ground to some other people around me. I 
I don't think you can drive any other car. Any road car is the best car. Last lap. Oh my God. That's going to be more relevant to me right now. Pass me on the left here, Billy. Okay. Almost drove in too hard. Good. They look like they're about to start battling up there. That could bring them back to us. I think the 8 probably makes a move on them here. Yep. Almost overdrove it. We're good though. Shifted a little late. Oh, we got a spinner. Ooh, that was Joe. That makes me realize we haven't really seen very many people spawn or anything. Lots of people uh, putting in consistent laps. I'm not one of them, because I spawn. <laughs> but uh, whoever was behind us had trouble getting around that, I think, maybe. Gavin going for the pass again. Stay on the outside there. Oh, he breaks so much earlier than I expected him to. Six to go, they're side by side. I gotta break early. It's like the aid's kind of getting all kinds of squirrely up there. This is fun, man. Difficult, but really fun. Oh, there's an off track. Oh, no, it's not. I, I guess you can go further than I thought right there. Bad turn one. Oh, 
Wow, he's getting really loose up there through the S's. Still pulling away from us, though. Pretty good corner right there, pretty good carousel. He had a couple of bad corners, I think. I'm <laughs> hitting way too much curve right there. Sixth place. Where are you going? I'm going. Fuck you, man. I would have let you buy on the straight where I'm supposed to. Pass me that here. Appreciate it. Oh god, this is so intense. Alright, so we got three laps to go. We've kind of caught back up to this eight just a bit. Whew. I know I can't, I'm not saying much. It's really hard to even focus on anything but driving through this. Oh, he's in the grass a little bit. My, pe my pedals are like sideways, by the way, because they've been slipping because I've been hitting the gears or the pedals so hard. to drill that. Two laps remaining. Don't wait too long. Find that gap. So we got a second behind, that's good. Don't have to worry about that, I don't think, unless I make a mistake. Got really, really sketchy there. On breaking. We might just be headed for a sixth place finish, and that would be just fine. White flag, last lap. Pushing it through the S's. 
Ooh, he hits some curb. We're gonna gain some time on him here. Not nearly enough, though, I don't think. <laughs> I pushed it hard. I'm trying, but don't think I'm gonna get there. Really nice race, Matthias and Wallace. It's, it's really tough to get a run here. I right, get race, man. You were tough. Whew. We were about the same pace we went the whole race. We were, I was, we were just better. Oh man. Run. My desk is sideways, my pedals are sideways. <laughs> yeah, I thought I had something from the side early, but I'm a mess. I just ran my tires off. Yeah, I have a carrot there. I was very solid in there. Good race, good win. Good job. <laughs> Wowzers. Okay, so that spin I had was the only yep, fun race, everybody. incident I had. Whew. Go in, Billy. I'll you take sixth place. I think the grips on my steering wheel are several oh, millimeters really thinner now. now. <laughs> I pulled my desk like halfway across the room. <laughs> wow. All right, so. I uh, wore out my right rear, or my rears, to 74 and 82. <laughs> I was really getting on it. Can't throw everything you learned out the window. Oh uh, yeah, everything you learned about road racing, probably. Because, <laughs> wow, this is crazy. These things, driving on a road course. But, uh, I will take it. I think if I don't spin, I probably, you know, I'm probably still around third, fourth, over there. Because um, I was just struggling to try to get past landing up there. Um, I don't even know if I deserve to be past them, though, because, you know, it's so many corners out here. I was a little bit faster in some corners, maybe, but he was faster in others, and so we were kind of just real close. And uh, just that it was just that one time I had to hit the brakes a little bit too hard, and it spun me around. But... Uh, whew, that was, that was fun, but took a couple years off my life, maybe. <laughs> the stress. So, let's see what happened out here. Sure, we'll have our little spin. Kind of gives us a good run. Whew. Looks like he and Nick were battling for a little bit there. I thought I saw them next to each other. So they probably had some fun stuff to watch. So lap one. I have a spinner. That is what gave us some room, I think. I remember we had a little bit of a gap right off the start. People checking for uh, up for that. I suppose it was. Oh, we got some grass. Lap two. Oh, seven way overcooks it right there, and then everyone's bouncing off of everybody. Ooh, sixteen's bouncing around. Gavin sneaks by. I think that's Nick up there too. Where did Nick go? <laughs> he. Oh, he was the one in the grass. He avoided the, uh, or got on the brakes a little too hard, sent him to the left. But it's probably a good thing, because he would have been in that, maybe. Otherwise, who knows. This guy's driving way too hard through the S's for this car. You could just tell, like, like that was not a good positioning to be in, but heck, it kind of worked.
Oh, there's that unsettled under braking. That's part of the reason I upped my brake bias forward, because that was happening to me way too much. And I want to be able to get on the brakes hard, and it, it still wasn't even enough to prevent me from spinning out later in the race. So, I'm glad I did that. Oh, three just can't avoid them. Unfortunately. Whoa, whoa! If I, we have multiple people getting messed up here. So this is lap three, and this is the guy that we were trying to catch up to at the end, so... <laughs> we're pretty similar on pace, and we ended up next to each other because we both had a spin-out moment. So he just overdrives it, it looks like, and then... Oh yeah, he was on it way too long. And uh, just can't get it slowed down without it spinning on him. Wait till you see the secret ice spinning on lap 11. We'll see it. I'm sure we will. And then we have the 22. Also, it looks like he breaks really late. And then... Right next to him. That was kind of secret ice spinning right there. Therefore, find some of the little bit of remaining sand trap here at Watkins Glen. Ooh, 18 loses it in the S's. 11's drifting it. No way he saved that. Okay, yeah, he ends up in the tire barrier. I'm like, there's no way he makes it out of this without getting damage. I would have been completely shocked. 16 drifts up into the 22. That could have been far worse. He just mows the lawn a little bit. 21 has to stab the brakes because he was about to get in the back of the guy. Well, a dangerous spot to be in. If you got someone too wide right there, then that's dangerous, but everything turned out okay. Shane, ooh, pretty hard into the wall there. 22, having a lot of trouble with the carousel. And find some tire barrier. Oof. And 19 was doing pretty good, just blinks right there. Nick and Gavin, what's happened? Oh! Payback! <laughs> That's payback from Gavin! Is he still here? <laughs> he gets into the back of him. <laughs> Just a couple of different breakings, breaking zones, I think. <laughs> Since Nick and the outside wall. Oh, they're gonna have round two of their fist fight on the apron afterward. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, shout out to Billy, by the way, winning by 11 seconds, just sweeping the floor with the field. That's crazy. Oh, here's the uh, synchronized spinning. That's funny. That's so much later than I normally break right there, uh, where Shane hit the brakes. They both hit the brakes much later. I don't know if that's why. Maybe I break too soon, but uh, they both spin it. <laughs> I don't know if that's the synchronized spinning. Yeah, it must have been, because this is Chad who was talking about it. That's the synchronized spin. It's just you get on those brakes too hard, and it just it'll go around on you. Does everybody make it by? Sure looks like it. 24, way overcooking it. That is a... Oh. Broken race car. The tire berries aren't uh, too comfy in real life, but they're 
probably even less comfy in iRacing, because they don't really give like they would in real life. Shane. Yeah, the wall. A little bit of grass. Oh, it's it's a been a rough one. Hmm. Inside wall there. I guess you can call it inside wall. Twenty one just never gets a turn. Oh no, that's the end of the race. Okay, so we don't even get to see um my spin out. I like the Halloween scheme too. Yeah, he killed it this race. That was awesome for Billy. Um, I will go ahead and take a look at my spin out because I don't deserve to get away with it. It was lap nine. Just, just broke on me. It just snapped. I got it slowed down pretty well too. Uh, just a tiny bit past my normal braking zone. It looked like I was catching up to uh, the number five really quick, so I got kind of uh, kind of nervous. And I think I just hit the brake just a little too hard. Wow, you almost can kind of see the moment. It's like you just can't 100% the brakes. Because you'll see, the moment I do, about 99% right there is when it starts snapping. And I just couldn't save it. There was no grip anymore. I didn't start going too soon, did I? No, it was good. I had room. So that's what allowed a couple guys to get around me. 19 comes up on me and I have to battle him for a little bit later. But I do end up passing both the guys that passed me. So uh, Joe had a mistake later and then... <laughs> Snack is funny. So I just want to let him yeah, I was racing with those guys for a little bit. <laughs> But uh, that'll be it for the race. That was very fun, actually. I really enjoyed that. I did better than I expected I would. With a 6th place finish. Gonna gain 10 road eye rating. And... Um, I don't know, probably break even on the safety rating? I don't know. Doesn't matter either way. <laughs> probably gonna look pretty similar. As to what I started before. So, uh, Thanks for watching. Be sure to watch... Nick, Gavin, Gavin Ropchins, Ropchans, I don't know how to say his name, I'm sorry, Ropchan. Watch his video too, um, watch everybody's video, I don't even know who all has videos, but uh, I recommend them. There's fights all up and down the field here, whole different race essentially. So, um, thank you for watching, I will see you next time, and I hope you have a good one.